don't wanna pull it. Guaranteed to have a nigga burning up bullets. No, 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 sit mad, I'll pull it. Bella did an all black mask in the hoodie. This ain't what you want, boy, don't do it. No remorse, won't hesitate to shoot it. Yeah, you don't, you don't wanna, you don't wanna pull it. Guaranteed to have a nigga burning up bullets. No, 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 sit mad, I'll pull it. Next group is our next guest right here, MIC. What's going on, man? What's up? What's up? Man? Uh, tell us a little something about yourself. Anybody? Yeah, we do music, you know. Uh, we're from the west side of Chicago. We fuck with our east, too. We have you. We, um, you go look us up on um, YouTube at um, MIC is a slaughter, on Twitter at Comac MIC, and on Facebook at Comac MIC. Shit, we got we just did some big videos. We um if you go on D Games channel, we the first video up there. And if you go on Zay video channel, we the first video video on both of their channels. They just shot a couple of videos for. Okay. Right. How long you been doing music? Shit, shit, what? We yeah, we ain't we as a as a group. We've been doing this for like three months. You know what I'm saying? Okay. But as a um, solo artist, we've been you know most of be all our lives. We're shorty like thirteen around that age. Okay. So what's up? So how would you guys describe your style of music? We got all type of styles, but we mainly hip hop shit from a crowd like, you know, from 13 to shit 30. Okay. 50, <laughs> 50 13 to 50. We can make all type of music. <laughs> 50, uh. yeah, yeah. So you guys are pretty versatile. Yeah. Yeah, that's what's up. You should definitely be versatile. I think it helps create more opportunities for you all. So what are your goals, some of your goals for, your, for you guys' career? Get that check. I'm trying to get that check. I'm trying to get that. And let the for the world hear more. Yeah. Music, you know. Um, and that check. What do, What do you guys feel like you uh bring bring to the table that hasn't been done quite yet in hip hop? Well, this group thing that we got going, you know, what I'm saying it's working real good. You know, what I'm saying it's three different styles and we all go hard. You know, what I'm saying so. I get like it's, it's been a lot of groups, but you know what I'm saying. I feel like we gonna be that one, though. You know what I'm saying. It's gonna stand out. So the three of y'all don't sound alike. No, yeah, that know. that's a good thing, cause like a lot a lot of cats I hear they like groups or whatever. Like yeah, you can't distinguish one like. rapper from the other. Cause yeah. when they they be around each other so much, they sound but like introduce each one of you. And the group we MIC our group called MIC the M stand for Mikey Dollars. You know what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. I L L. That's the what the I stand for. Oh. Chris is for look Chris for the C. Okay. You know, I got like a West Side style. He got like an East Side style, and he got like a just he yeah, got well. a style. Yeah. You know, he <laughs> he got, he got any style. type of style, you know. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's what's up. So where do you all gain inspiration from for your lyrics? Um, that's a good question. Like shit, what we what we what going on in the street? Yeah. Shit, what going on in the hood every day in my life? Same mm -hmm. shit, just different day. So what made you guys branch out to hip-hop? Shit, I liked it since I was a shorty. Yeah, really. Music, you know what I'm saying? It's attractive, you know? Then I, I used to just play around. Then it got a little serious when everybody started, you know what I'm saying? Liking my music, you know what I'm saying? So I have to listen to it. In real life, like, oh, wait, I can sell this shit. Yeah, yeah. Like, I'm gonna get on off of it. Yeah, right, that's, that's what happened, man. <laughs> yeah, wait, 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 Okay. Okay. That's what's happening. That's what's happening. So, with that being said, how do you feel? How do you guys feel about the current state of hip hop in Chicago as a whole? Do you think we have come together as a city? Because some people call us the city of haters. Uh, do you feel that we've shown unity? I mean, I know with you guys being from the west side, there's always a separation between the west side and south side, and you know, there's always some type of discrepancy <laughs> between the two just because of what side you come from. But what do you guys think about the current state of hip hop in Chicago? Shit, it, it's getting better, you know. It's, it's looking better than it was. People starting to stick together more than it was back then, Shit, I guess. But it is a kind of like a west side, east side thing, like where you from, that's who gonna, you're going to stick with, you know what I'm saying? But, you know, I'm from my wife, born and raised, I was, but I was born, I was out there east too, you know what I'm saying, in Drove City and stuff, you know, 79th Street, you know what I'm okay. saying? So, mm -hmm. we got a couple of people out there who rock with us too, you know what I'm saying? But we're trying to catch up with them, you know what I'm saying? Trying to get their fan base, you know what I'm saying, where we're supposed to be at. Yeah, we yeah. got, we, we like, we like not to be caught, you know, we like the only um, west side people, you know, the, that the east side, you know, they the main, they been a focus. That they've been rocking with, you know. Yeah, they rock with us hard. Like most of the out west, like out west, a lot, a lot of out west niggas don't get no attention. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? But they rock with us hard. A lot of people rock with us hard. Right, that is the, it's the funny shit to me though. Like you know, I mean, cause I'm a west side dude, mm -hmm. and, and the fun, the funny thing about that is like, 
you know, it's all the separation with the west side, the south side, or whatever. But but at the same time, the same shit happened in both all the time. There's really no difference. You know what I mean? Like, it's really not a difference. And you know, you hear south side cats be like, "Niggas out west crazy." It's like, nah, I, we all crazy. You know I mean? Like like y'all ain't no different. So I mean, yeah, I, I'm glad to see cats are sticking together, especially like younger cats like yourselves, man. They are banding together because like a a lot of older guys, it was it was a lot of separation. So I, I think, you know, a lot of the younger guys are, are, are kind of, you know, dispelling that whole thing that was going on. And I, I appreciate y'all for doing that. Uh, is there any artists in Chicago you respect right now? Any groups, artists, anybody? Shit. Yeah, you know, Norman, Louis, Keith, Mr. Sam, Shazio. Yeah, Poker Face. Yeah, Poker Face. They make a big move too, you know. A1. Yeah, A1, you know what I'm saying, Stang Gang. And Bo Deal, you know. Yeah, we rock with Bo Deal a too. Yeah. Good. It's, it's good to hear a female. Shout out to Chill. <laughs> you know, not to hear the women. You be like, you watch her, um, um, her shit, the videos you put out yesterday? Which one? I got um, Who a Bitch America Rivers. episode of Real Bitch America. <laughs> yeah. But you know, Chella, like, honestly, no like, you, you understand, like, I, but but before Chella started to pop, like, we've been homies a while. You know what I mean? Like, and, and, Motherfuckers say what they want, but that's really who she is, bro. You know, like, I mean, she the most genuine motherfucker ever. Like, you know what I mean? Like, if she would give you the shirt off her motherfucking back, like, I'm serious. That's really who she is. She she has no buffer, so what you see is what you what you get. And then may, she may not always say the right shit, but she really be that shit. That's who the fuck she is, man. You know what I'm saying? Growing uncut. That's what's up, Chella. Yeah, she rock with us hard, bro. Yeah, shout out, Chella. Yeah. Man. Yeah, fuck with Sasha, too. She go hard, too. She go stupid. We just, he just, I'm on the ill will. We just did a song, huh? No, a song okay. Young Buck, too. We got a song Young Buck on our next, mix, uh, next to Blow mixtape. Okay, shit. That's, that's what's that's up. What's up? All right. Well, definitely big ups to you guys for doing your thing. You guys have any shows lined up? On the 11th uh, with Rick Ross. So, the Super Fest. And the Super uh, Fest. Mm -hmm. yeah, the yeah, got, the Super um, Fest. Yeah. The Industry Showcase um, in New York on um, August 21st, too. We got that going on, too. And next yeah. month, a show in Atlanta, too. Good. That's what's up. It's good that you guys are branching outside of the neighborhood, outside of the city, and that you guys are, you know, obviously have a good team because you're marketing yourselves, obviously, properly. Mm -hmm. You're going to New York, you're going to Atlanta. You know, you guys are stepping outside the box. That's a, one thing, one of the downfalls of Chicago artists. A lot of them, you know, as long as they have, you know, they, they neighborhood people like them. Huh? We hot, we dope instead of, you know, venturing out to different Right, the hamster wheel. Right. Right, the hamster wheel. Yeah. Right. So you, you guys grind is obviously showing it. So. What's your uh, favorite city to do music in? Favorite city? Oh, yeah. city what? Favorite city to perform in? I uh, home, man. I mean, yeah. I like home. Wow. What's up? Ain't nothing like home. <laughs> <laughs> this actually be our um first show at the city though. Oh, okay. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So we get a chance to experience that for the first time really. Hey, so Y'all get a lot of love. Day. Yeah, we got a lot of love. Like it's a lot of people fucking us along with like heavy, heavy. Like, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Cause we good people in the streets and then and we all style. When y'all go to the A though, I promise you you're gonna get a lot of love. Like you you're gonna see like I mean when you when you move around outside of Chicago um, the, just the whole perception of, you know, um, the whole perception of, of, of Chicago is a lot different. Like, we perceive it one way because we're here, you know what I mean? Like, and, and when you go to places, I used to stay in Atlanta. Uh, when, when I was signed to Universal, I used to stay in Atlanta. And, and the whole perception of, of Chicago there is different than we see it. You know, people always, you never know how people perceive your house until you step outside of it, you know what I mean? So, so I mean, yeah, as long as y'all go down there and rock out, man, like, like trust me, y'all gonna get a lot of love and y'all gonna get a following because those people fuck with music like all types. Yeah. Are you guys working with any DJs? Yeah, we can um, actually move them to them with DJ Victorious, DJ City, you know what I'm saying? They, they work with us all. Aramis, that's the thing, Mars. Yeah, shout out DJ City. Uh, yeah, DJ Ferris, he, he got us in a regular rotation on um, the radio. Yeah, he, so put out, he put out a little song on, on the new Chicago mixtape, too. Yeah. Which song is that? Let's let Get It. That's a song called Let's Get It. You guys see, we, just saw, we just saw the video on Alvin Elmore, just saw a video for that. Oh, okay. okay. Drop Sunday. Same beat, um, Chella H, um, Sonny got for that, Big and Fat. Big and Fat, okay. Yeah, same beat, okay. I'm sorry for those. 
not supposed to. Oh, all right, that's what's up. I'm gonna check it out, man. We gonna drop it. We got we got a lot of things on uh, YouTube though. Y'all can go type it out. And what's the YouTube channel? Uh, MIC. It's a slaughter. And, or you could just type MIC Lil Chris or MIC Mikey Dollars or um, MIC IEL Will. Any one of them because we got solo videos too. The views be it be looking good. And it ain't no cheating, really, you know. Everybody talk about and, and purchase you know, YouTube that, views that, now. I, and I'll tell you, I'll, I'll take pride in that because I'll be promoting the hell out of some of my videos. And then just to get get up to a thousand, I'll be happy. Like, good, a thousand <laughs> a week, I'm happy. But And I see a motherfucker go from 350 to 14,000. I'm like, lousy bitch. Like, <laughs> you know, I mean, to play devil's advocate to that, like Sluggo just said before he left, he's like, it's the game, baby. Like, and, and, and I know firsthand, music and the business don't have shit to do with each other. Like, it's just the game, baby. Sometimes you got to pay to play, bro. Like, cause like, <laughs> I, like all of these suits understand and all of these execs, is that like yeah. they don't care about the the genuineness of, of your craft or how dope of an MC you are? They look at numbers. This dude got numbers. I can pitch it. I can sell it. I can trip. They hustlers. They look man. at quantity, not yeah, quantity. Yeah, yeah. They hustlers, bro. Like you understand? Like this is what they do. It's like stocks. They flip shit. Right. So th that's all they care about. Wow. You know, it's it's yeah, it's, it's it's fucked up from the artistic standpoint, but from the business standpoint, I understand. You know. Absolutely. Oh, what's up? You got any? Uh, what's your Facebook and Twitter? So anybody want to reach you to book you? What's the best way? Um, you can go at um, at Comac M I C, K O M A C K M I C on Twitter and Facebook, and then our uh, separates on Twitter. I'm at Look Chris K Town on Facebook and Twitter. Um, on Twitter, you can um, catch me, um, Mikey underscore Dollars underscore on Twitter. And on Facebook, you just catch me, Mikey Dollars. Type of Mikey Dollars. You know, on Twitter, you can catch me at. Ill will. Wait, hold on. You gotta bring bring the mic down a little bit. On Twitter, you can give me an I L will underscore M I C. That's one I one L will underscore M I C. On Facebook, you can give me an Ill will the kid the kid together D A K I D. I hit the tap that mic. Okay. Yeah. Damn. Yeah. All right. Oh, 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 All right. Say that. Do that one more time, bro. The whole thing. Yeah. 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 On Twitter, you can give me an I L will underscore M I C. On Facebook, you can find me at Ill Will the Kid with the kid together, D A K I D. You know, it's a comedian named Ill Will, right? From, nah. the, and from, from Chicago, from the low end. <laughs> yeah. Look him up up there, he's he funny as hell. <laughs> <laughs> they got Larry. But he is spelled different, though, man. It's I L L, -L, 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 -L yeah. Will, yeah. Mm, but yeah, he ill funny. Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah.